hello, this is just a short video to show how the way the Loughborough University website set up gives the wrong impression about uh, insurance, particularly uh, bike cover. Uh, it's uh, occurred, happened to me because my son's gone to Loughborough um, and he's had his bike stolen. I'd assumed that uh, it was covered by the accommodation insurance and it, we've now been told that it's not. Okay, so here's the Loughborough University website. I go to study with us and accommodation. <coughs> I get this website here. Um, if we, he's he falls into this category. He said he's got a firm choice for accommodation, and so he's guaranteed a room in university hall accommodation. Okay, so as far as I can see, the hall is part of the university. The university has provided that in accommodation. Go to halls. And there's a list of all the halls here. They're all very much part of Loughborough, Loughborough University. Um, and this is the hall that he's been allocated, Harry French Hall. Okay, let's click on that. Again, very much Loughborough University. Um, it is, as far as I'm concerned, all the information here is that this is a university hall's residence. Now, if you look carefully, it does say it's owned and managed by our partners, Unite Students. Now I have now found out that this is a different. This is a company, Unite Students. Um, they're contracted by the university to provide this hall as a residence, um, and the terms and conditions are slightly different. Now I can't see anywhere any indication on this side page here that that's the case. That the terms and conditions are different. So. I wanted to know a bit more and I had specifically looked up insurance. Would what would be covered by the insurance and particularly would this bike be covered? So I went to what we provide. But bearing in mind this is the Harry French Hall, what we provide is one of the links. And it's all about the halls of residence. Um, again, okay, it does indicate there's four our uh, halls are provided by a, another service provider doesn't say anything about terms and conditions interesting down here will I need to arrange insurance now remembering this has come from the Harry French page click on here uh, and I've got a number of questions and answers will I need to arrange insurance and we look down here and very clearly bicycle cover up to 300 pounds so yes schools are covered by the insurance very clearly so how can it not be the case well let's see can we find out um, any reason for it not to be covered well if I go to here these documents and forms I found this since certificate of insurance now bearing in mind I hadn't realized the unite students was a separate entity I come here, Unite, but it's not Unite Students. So you know, I, I know of Unite as a union. I don't, it's not really valid, interesting to me. So I would click on University. And sh very clearly, bike cover, £300. It's covered. And yes, if you click on Unite, if you happen to think strangely, um, there's nothing in here to say why you, this would apply, Unite Students Loughborough. And interestingly, the form looks is almost exactly the same. It just so happens that the bike cover has been moved from benefits to exclusions. So yes, if I knew that this applied and I'd looked at this page, I would know that bikes weren't insured. But to me, that's a, a complete nonsense to suggest that we should have known that. So this website is definitely giving the wrong impression about insurance cover, particularly where bikes are concerned. Um, it also gives them the wrong impression about uh, bike storage because it does say uh, bike sheds are provided, secure bike sheds are available, and again, they're not at Harry French. So all in all, uh, a very unsatisfactory uh, situation. Thank you.